Hey everyone, we're back for another round. Oh, trip, oh. Got this weird cut tank top. I bought it, didn't try it on. So, working with that today. <laughs> Nate said that he's gonna show his breasts with this tank top. This is completely ridiculous. <laughs> Stop. So, no cleavage. What, what we're doing today is a limited time. Mexicano corn chips, sriracha. So, I'm already conflicted because that ain't Mexicano, that's Asian. We're gonna sriracha? give it a try. Give it a sniff. Okay, so straight off the bat to me, corn chips. I don't like smelling chips. I think <laughs> it just sets it off weird. I mean, I definitely smell some spice. Yeah, it's definitely sure. spiced up. Classic corn chip. But they're like darker. They've got a, they've got some spice on there. Oh my God. I just dropped like all these crumbs. Muscle crumbs are in between my toes now. But you know what? This is a pretty good chip. Man, this is a really good chip. Yeah. Like. It's really good. Almost has like a hint of lime. This is like one of my favorite corn chips, I swear. It's decently spicy, not like crazy. Jake could still eat this. Autumn would like these. Yeah, I think everybody would like these. Like, I'm getting subtle sriracha, but enough to make it really good. It also shows garlic on the bag. Yeah. Which I can taste. Yeah. But flavor to name, I'm gonna have to give it a seven. It could be more sriracha. -y. How are you gonna give it? Yeah, I think I'm gonna give it a six and a half on flavor because if I pulled these out of a, a bowl, like I wouldn't know that they were sriracha flavored. I mean, just know that they were either. like heavy spice. Same. But, so I don't think it's that close on the flavor to name, but I'm still gonna give it a six because it does have like the spice aspect that sriracha would have. But overall quality, I'd give these like an eight or nine. I don't know, they're super great. I'm gonna give the crunch 10 out of 10. It's a nice corn chip. It's not like those last corn chips that are gonna hard. It's a perfect corn chip. Sturdy enough for dipping, but also, you know, not a gum trasher, really good tasting chip. It doesn't even hurt in your teeth. It's perfect, I can eat this whole bag. Overall for me- We will eat this whole bag. Overall for me, I'm gonna give this an eight out of 10. I'm gonna give it the same. Eight out of 10. I'd it's recommend this. Chip. I'd recommend this bag to everyone. Gluten free? Gluten free, so right up Kate's alley. But you know what? They're Mexican corn chips made right here in New Zealand. So they'd be super good with like. You're not gonna get your hands on them. Nachos or any dips. Honestly, by themselves, they're delicious. So. What a weird concept, you know? Mexicano chips out of New Zealand. There's no Mexicans here. Where might be a few? There might be a few. Okay, I just got a hot one. That was nice. All right, y'all. Mm. Good luck. Find these chips wherever you live. Order them on Amazon. They probably don't have them. They have them in Auckland. That's where we are today. All right. Oh, well, before I go, I also got this crazy flavored Powerade called Fever Pitch. I just- Ninja Turtle Green. Yeah, it's super green. And I found out that it's for the rugby. It's named Fever Pitch after rugby. It's a limited edition. I'm not sure what the flavor is. Tastes like a melon. Callie's thinking melon kiwi. Yeah. It's melon something. It definitely has kiwi in it. But I can't find online what it is. So I might have to reach out to the Coca-Cola company and figure that out. But talk to y'all later. Looking forward to more Spicy Boys chip reviews. I mean, uh, hot sauce reviews. Can't wait to see you guys getting into the deeper heat. Love you. Love you too. Chip it up. Chip till you die.